So in this video, <coughs> I want to see if I'm able to check my uh, hard disk that I just installed on my computer. So is it showing up or not? And I think it is. It should be this one. So that means that the hard drive that I installed physically on my computer, it's showing up. If <coughs> you you're like me and you were having issues <coughs> with the hard drive, uh, hard drive uh, with your um, um, M.2 disk. So basically you have six drives in there. And if you try to install it in one of the, let's check chipset, it's showing up right here, this one right there. So we are good here. We can go and do, uh, like log into the windows. But the quick tip is that if you install it, there are six uh, setup ports, um, six GBUs, whatever. There are six, but you get to see only two when you are looking at from the God's view, like from the up above and they are disabled if you use you are using the m.2 because as soon as it detects that there there's m.2 it reserved those two uh, setup ports to uh, for m.2 because they share it with that because there are two m.2 slots in this particular motherboard that is gigabyte b350 <coughs> so there is there are four more ports they are accessible through the side so if if you have installed a um, i don't know if i could show you it's down there but the, uh, where you see the two setup ports if you go down like a yeah the maybe about four inches down there are like a box that is you don't have no idea but if you look at from sideways you will see four more and from there you can connect your S uh, HDD and it should work so that's the pro tip I didn't I made the uh, mistake of doing that um, startup it was not showing up in here so I searched and I found the answer and then you know I unhook my cables open up the case uh, connected the SATA to the correct one and now it's showing up so if you are having that issue try to do that now uh, if this video has helped you please rate comment subscribe and share and i see you in the next one